you know what? These people are not my enemy. They, you know, I've always found this bizarre when you walk into a medical appointment and it's like this us against them mentality. And I feel like they, you know, they'll walk in when you're chronically ill and, and your health is declining and, you know, on average, it can, t it, it, on, this is proven, a, a proven statistic on average, it takes seven years to diagnose a, a, a chronic disease. When you have a rare disease, it can take twice as long. And, um, so I have two rare diseases, uh, Chiari malformation and Ehlers-Danlos syndrome. They want to keep that out of my medical records, right? I have, I, I, that's been proven with, uh, brain MRIs. It's not a question. I, I have this brain condition and a con connective tissue disease, which is affecting me in all, all sorts of ways. Ehlers Danlos syndrome is so misunderstood and doctors doctors think it's you're just bendy. Well, it affects everything. And uh you know, I have all sorts of hernias and uh, um abdominal hernias and a brain hernia and organ organ prolapses and uh you know my connective tissue is, is, you know, it, it, it's a connective tissue disease, weak connective tissues, weak connective tissue. And anyways, um, I forget what I was going to say. As you're declining and, 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 fighting for health care doctors i feel like i go for medical help and it's like oh well like you know and i've never met them met the doctor before and it's like they come in and like uh okay well what is this person trying to get out of me right what are you trying to get out of me that you don't deserve or or that you shouldn't have or what kind of tests are you pushing for that you shouldn't have and it's always been like that. It's it's an us against them mentality. And I feel like they think that we are the problem. Like, um, like imagine, you know, you're a patient, you're sick. These are medical doctors. They go into pre medicine, presumably to help people. You go for help and you're being treated in the spirit of, well, what now? Or... What are you trying to get out of me that you don't deserve or that what kind of tests are you asking for now that you probably shouldn't be having, you know? It's like, well, this is what you're there for, right? I'm I'm suffering and you're a medical doctor, right? Like you shouldn't have to feel like you're an inconvenience. You know, and I think they really think that this us against them mentality comes from us, that we think, you know, they're the enemy. I don't, I don't ever think that. And I think this whole men, this us against them mentality is created by them. And I'm blown away by, by the level of patient profiling, uh, the level of disrespect, the, this weird thing about fighting to keep what's wrong with you out of your medical records, maybe that's all based on, maybe that's much, much worse if you have had medical injuries or medical um, misdiagnosis.
But then again, too, not all doctors are like that. Like there are, you know, there are, are a few doctors who can walk through the door and try to look at your case through new eyes. But I don't think most doctors have that ability. They keep in line with the shitty narrative that's been created in your medical records. And walk in like as if you're trouble, right? All I've ever wanted is health care. There's, no, there's been no other objective other than to, to just get timely qualified health care. But it's bizarre when, when you're seeing, uh, you know, when you're seeing deception and gaslighting and, you know, you're being deceived about, uh, like, it, it's bizarre to see the triangulation and withholding of, of, of resources and, um, you know, denying... A, a doctor covering up the errors that were made and denying what actually happened and um, trying to minimize, you know, like you're st stopping breathing nonstop. And, you know, you can prove how critically sleep deprived you are. And they're trying to, to deny how ill you are. And I'm suffering from hypoventilation. They're fighting to keep that out of my medical record. So why are they doing that? Are they doing that because I have a brain condition they don't want to treat? Or are they doing that because they think it's this is part of my medical injury? That hypoventilation is a, is a result of my medical injury.